gratitude for the resonance of the full moon alchemy lunar eclipse in Taurus moon in Taurus in oppositional alignment with Sun in Scorpio Taurus and Scorpio coming together to reveal one another to each other. Representing the divine remembrance of the celestial beingness of the soul individualized by virtue of the oneness of the wholeness coming now into the cellular remembering the remembering of true beingness, the alchemy of the central core of the soul. By virtue of the alchemical frequency of Scorpio, remembering, remembering, remembering who we are, remembering where we are from, remembering that we are divine, sending forth the divine intention of the alchemical mastering of the T-square to Saturn in Aquarius. Saturn in Aquarius squaring the full moon lunar eclipse, squaring moon in Taurus and sun in Scorpio, emphasizing the resonant intention to be responsible, Saturn, for the resonant connection of relationship, that relationship which is created from above and is a vessel for the journey of love as we are sailing upon the human seas and the mirrors of self that set us free as our human goal above any other to reveal one another to each other. When I relate to you, I learn and I see that my greatest learning is always about me. So relationship must be the key to my self-mastery. 
As the past is gone and the future takes too long, as it is time to sing a current song for emotional pain from long ago within my heart rips to and fro how many others will I blame for the horrors of my pain Resentment push me from the tower. Forgiveness is my get-up power. Forgive the past. Trust the present. Make the future sweet and pleasant. It is wise not to despise it. Use the dawn to fertilize it for life's greatest connoisseur gets the best crops from the best manure accountability for self mastery accountability for Recognizing that we come together to reveal one another to each other. Accountability for the alignment with cosmic consciousness. Cosmic consciousness of Uranus and Taurus conjunct the lunar eclipse, full moon in Taurus. Aligning with the frequency of cosmic consciousness. Aligning with the frequency of the all that is. The Akashic Records, the book of God's remembrance, that alignment with our sacred subconscious wherein lies the knowledge of all things by virtue of the oneness of the wholeness of being we sacredly align with the truth that we are the focalization of the all that is the focalization of every being that is, was, or ever shall be. The divine remembering that each and every one of us are the microcosmic container of the macrocosmic all that is. We align with, intend, and become the sacred remembering of the all that is, that we all are. We are so honored to each of us be an individual expression of Creator Source, an individual expression of that which is unduplicatable. We are a unique and unduplicatable blessing unto create a source each and every one of us giving something unto create a source that create a source cannot get any where else and we celebrate this reality we celebrate this Lunar Eclipse, Full Moon, in Taurus. 
embracing the sacred resonance of the supreme value that we are by virtue of being individualized descendants of God Almighty. And within the individualization of our being, we are the microcosmic container of the macrocosmic all that is. We are soul in the body of the universe as the universe is a multifaceted cell in the body of our soul. sacred accountability to own the inner divinity of our being, the recognition of the individualization of God Goddesshood within the central core of our being. We offer a counterpart of this blessed remembering unto every being in all existence, everyone, everywhere, every when, from beginningless beginning to endless end, we Remember who we are. We remember where we're from. We remember that we are divine what was lost. We have now found. We rem remember as we align with the Eastern time of 602 in the a.m. on the 8th of November, the exact time of this lunar eclipse full moon. And we align with the mercurial resonance of our being, the frequency of Mercury in Scorpio, in oppositional alignment with Uranus in Taurus, Uranus being the resonance of the higher mind of cosmic consciousness, as Mercury is the everyday mind. And we align the lower mind with the higher mind and create the quickening and the upleveling of the mercurial mind into the exaltation of Uranian frequency of consciousness. We remember, we remember, we remember. We call forth the resonant vibrations of the Venus and Scorpio in the harmonic mix of this lunar eclipse. 
full moon. And we are in alignment with our divine accountability in the domain of relationship. In the recognition that the beloved is an external mirror of our own self. And so as we look in the mirrored reflection of every beloved, we allow the up-leveling and the quickening of our individual being, the alignment with divine empowerment. We come home to ourself. We remember, we remember, we remember. We remember who we are. We remember where we're from. We remember that we are divine. What was lost, we have now found. We remember and we are walking on wings Riding the bliss ascension brings. Danusi Driamu Awaku. Dance the dream awake. Danusi Driamu Awaku. Dance the love awake. Dance the peace awake. Dance the bliss awake. Namaste, Hotep in Lakesh, Alak in Shalom, Satnam Hariom Rastafari. Our sacred juices are cooked and infinitely expanding. Juice to far eye, bliss to far eye. Gonna always have many miles on our smile, wiggle in our giggle, tingling in our boots. Laughter ever after, putting our strut wings on our butt, always rising up. Up at the top, there's room for all. It's just the bottom that's crowded, y'all. And so it is, and so it shall. Eternally be. Danusi Driamu Awaku. Dance the dream. Awake. Wa ah wa u wa ung. We are riding the bliss ascension rings ascended reality are we for the residence of the full moon lunar eclipse in Scorpio so it is Ooh.